Hello everyone. Today I am going to tell the solution of this problem which is from CBSE sample paper 2023 standard paper. And here is the uh, problem. Anus had some chocolates and he divided them into two lots A and B. He sold the first lot at the rate of 4 rupees 2 for 3 chocolates and the second lot at the rate of 1 rupee per chocolate and got a total of 400 rupees. If he had sold the first lot at the rate of rupees 1 per chocolate and the second lot at the rate of rupees 4 for 5 chocolates, his total collection would have been for 60 rupees. Find the total number of chocolates he had. So in this problem, Anus had some chocolates and he has divided into two lots A and B. So here are the total chocolates and he has divided into two lots and he sold the chocolates uh, like this, ru 2 rupees for 3 chocolates in the first lot. So 3 chocolates price is 2 rupees. So 1 chocolate price is 2 by 3. So let the uh, total chocolates in the first lot that is in A, B, X chocolates and in the second lot B, Y chocolates then x chocolates price is 2 by 3 x because here 3 chocolates price is 2 and uh, 1 chocolate is 2 by 3 rupees. So x chocolates price is 2 by 3 into x. So in the first lot, the chocolates price is 2 by 3 x. And in the second lot, you can see here 1 rupee per chocolate. So this is second lot that is B. So 1 chocolates price is 1 rupee. So, Y chocolate price is Y rupees. So, here the total choc uh, the chocolate price in the second lot is Y rupees. In the first lot is 2 by 3 X rupees. So, if you add these two, then you will get total of 400 rupees. So, 2 by 3 X plus Y is equal to 400. Similarly, if he had sold the first lot at the rate of 1 rupee per chocolate. And in the second case, uh, here in the first lot, he sold the chocolates 1 rupee per 1 chocolate. That means X chocolates price is X rupees only. So directly you can write X plus. Here next to 5, 5 chocolates price is 4 rupees. See here 4 rupees for 5 chocolates. So 5 chocolates price is 4 rupees. So 1 chocolate is 4 by 5 rupees. So Y chocolates price is 4 by 5 into Y. Directly you can write this. And the total is given that is 460 rupees. So here the writing the equations is very important. So you have to write like this. Then if you see here it is uh, in the fraction form. So you have to multiply this equation with uh, 3 in here with 5. Then you will get 2x plus 3y is equal to 3 into 400 that is 1200. And here if you multiply this equation with 5 then you will get 5x plus 4y is equal to 5 into 460 that is 2300. And then if you want to eliminate any of uh, the variable, then you have to multiply, for example, here with 5 here and with 2, then you will get 10x, 10x here. So you can easily eliminate this term x term. So multiply this equation with uh, 5, then 5 2s are 10x plus 5 3s are 15y and 5 1200s are 6000. Then you have to multiply this with 2, then you will get 10x plus 8y is equal to here. 2300 into 2 that is 4600. Then subtract uh, this second equation from the first equation then you will get 10x minus 10x that is 0 and 15y minus 8y is 7y and 6000 minus 4600 is equal to 1400. Therefore y is equal to 1400 by 7 that is 200. Then substitute uh, this y value in this equation any of these two equations you can substitute. So here 2x uh, is equal to 1200 minus 3y. So minus 3 into 200. That is 2x is equal to 600. Then x is equal to 600 by 2. That is 300. So y is equal to 200 and x is equal to 300. So here x and y are the number of chocolates in each lot. So total number of chocolates is equal to x plus y. That is 300 plus 200. That is 500. 